My name is Melinda Jackson and my area of research is in sleep. Um, it spans sleep and uh, experimental and clinical psychology. My research is interested in looking at how sleep loss impacts on our um, functioning, our cognitive functioning and also on our moods. So um, I'm interested to see whether um, sleep deprivation in healthy people can affect how they feel during the day and how they function during the day. We know that um, as our population is ageing there's going to be higher rates of um, obstructive sleep apnea and, and also insomnia. So um, the impact of ageing on sleep um, is another area that I'm interested in focusing on. We're starting a new area of sleep research at RMIT. There's a newly established sleep laboratory at the Bundura campus. And so we're looking to um, develop the area of sleep research um, at RMIT and increase the profile of sleep. I love research. I, um, I think it's a very challenging um, field to be in. Um, I find that, um, particularly in the area of sleep, um, it's such a, it impacts on so many people. I really wanted an opportunity to um, really establish myself as a sleep researcher and give myself an opportunity to really just focus on my research for a good amount of time. Um, so for the next four years, um, it really gives me a great opportunity to um, develop my research agenda, um, and really produce high quality outputs and um, introduce sleep into RMIT. RMIT provides a lot of um, support for um, VC fellows just to make sure that we have um, everything that we need in order to achieve our research goals. For this next four years, I really plan to, um, as I say, develop um, this area of sleep at RMIT. Um, and really grow a, a sleep team, I suppose, um, and uh, continue to develop and um, uh, produce high quality research outputs. I felt a lot of support, um, both from the administrative team and also um, my other colleagues in research. Um, and I feel like I've, I've had a very smooth transition. Um, I've been given opportunities to do some teaching if I would like to, um, and access to um, higher degree students as well. So um, yeah, it's been a very smooth, easy transition.